In diesel engine, we, we compress only the air. When the air is fully compressed, it's supposed that uh, when the piston compress the air, the temperature in that area is 1,075 degrees Fahrenheit. And uh, the pressure is over 400 PSI. In that moment, when the injector spray the fuel, atomize the fuel, reduce the explosion. If you have both, both situation, temperature more than 1,000 degrees and pressure superior to 400 PSI. But uh, this is difficult in the uh, can you imagine to start a diesel engine today in the morning in Alaska, well, in New York? Because uh, probably at the beginning, when you compress that air, you don't reach that temperature. This is why the, some of the diesel engines, they have glove plugs. That element receives power, 12 volts, 12 volts, 12 volts, those those uh, uh, glove plugs, 12 volts, 12 volts, 12 volts, and, uh, and you produce a short to ground because that one is bolted here in the block. And I have 12 volts here. I produce a chart to ground yeah, over there. Sure. And mm. what happened with that element? Become hot. red, too hot, and preheat the combustion chamber. Mm. And this is why in, so, so. In, in, in the majority of diesel engines, you have a resistor. When you turn on the key, the resistor is, is, uh, uh, is, is yellow or orange, you remember? And you need to wait until the resistor disappears in the display. And after that, you crank it, and boom, it starts. What is the function of the glove plug? Preheat the combustion chamber. It's different than this one. This one produces spark and ignite. This one only preheat the area because this will not ignite for a spark. This will ignite if the diesel is introduced in an area with that temperature and that pressure. That's it.